I actually hurt myself in 2009 and I had gone to about five different doctors. Um, not one of them did an x-ray, asked for an MRI, did anything. They just pretty much said it was sciatic pain and that there was nothing they could do for me. Just stretch. Stretch. Lose weight. Weight loss. Um, take anti-inflammatories. Yeah, tons of pills. Um, and any other painkillers that might help. Um, but that was the only solutions that they had. That was it. Gotcha. Yeah, there, there, it was pretty, pretty dark at times. I mean, because I couldn't, I couldn't do things, and I've always been somewhat active and you know able to, able to do what I want, and then to not be able to and to be stuck in bed or stuck sitting all the time was really, really depressing. It, pain can be a really dark place, and it really was. I mean, because for five years, no one telling you any answers, no one giving you any hope on any of you know, your future, um, and you start thinking, do I want to live with this and how can I deal with this, and yeah. to come in here and have someone say, we can fix this, this is not going to you know, be your life for the rest of your life, um, that was just kind of reassuring for us and just helping out there. on my first um, exam asked me if I'd been heavy most of my life, which I have been, even when I was at my healthiest and, you know, playing tennis and walking and everything. And after we had discussed that, he was like, this isn't caused by your weight. So that's when he was like, we need to see what the real problem is. Yeah, I like the fact that he he's never once judged us um, or, or you as a patient, um, you know, as past doctors have said, you know, weight's an issue. It was, you know, it came up once and saying, um, well, of course, that's something you want to do later on. Mm -hmm. But right now, that's not our issue right now. We're, we're dealing with the back pain and, and the injury you have to your back. And, and you need to heal and then and, we can take care of it. And that. it's always been, um, you know, there's never been any judgment in who we are, what we do, how we got this way, you know, it's just, you have a problem and we're here to fix it for you. Mm -hmm. Dr. Campson kind of mapped out everything that she'd be feeling in the recovery and it was pretty true to it. I mean it was I mean there was some you know some days that were rougher in the recovery of course but um, when he outlined outlined how many days it would be before you start being able to do things, it's pretty close to that. Um, that kind of gave her that positive reassurance that okay there is light at the end of the tunnel. Now she's able to go through a normal day of work, um, come home, still be able to uh, be social and function around the house or you know just go out for the evening and without any medication to help or anything. So. <laughs> I know it sounds cliche uh, but if you're in this much pain and it's it's changed your life for the worse come in at least meet with the doctors and see, see what can happen. I mean seriously in less than a year my life has changed dramatically for the better.